how's it going? Onion Man here. And today we're going to be looking at some more games I picked up uh, in the last little while. Um, first game is a DS game. I didn't get a case for it, unfortunately. Uh, it would have been nice to get the case, but maybe I can find a case in the future. Um, it is Star Wars Battlefront Elite Squadron. Uh, just a cartridge. It is kind of a top-ish down style. I played a little bit of it just to see what it was like. I um, have to dig more into it yet. It is basically Star Wars Battlefront. You can play instant action, you have a campaign. Uh, looks really cool, so looking forward to playing that one. And then uh, second game uh, is called The Settlers. It's also a DS game. This one is, it is basically Age of Empires on the DS. Now I know there is a couple Age of Empires games on the DS actually, like official Age of Empires. But this is just a knockoff, it's made by Ubisoft. Um, it looks kind of fun actually. Uh, I just kind of jumped into it again, just quickly. Uh, I gotta kind of try to figure out the controls and how everything works on the bottom screen for the moving your buildings around to build and stuff. But once I figure that out then it should be really fun. Third game is NBA Street for the PS2. These uh, street games were actually a lot of fun. I played some of the NFL Street games and it's kind of cool because there's not a lot of rules so you can like I think there's like body checking and stuff and there's it's just different kind of rules than the regular NBA or NFL or whatever you're playing. Uh, Looks really cool. Found it at a thrift store. It was like five dollars, so I was like, why not? Let's get it. Don't normally buy sports games, but those are a little bit different, so I'll, I'll, I'll count those. Um, next ones, got a couple more Xbox games, original, original Xbox. Uh, first one, Monster 4x4 World Circuit. It is a Xbox exclusive. Basically, you go around and you drive monster trucks in four-player split screen or single player. You can do single player too. Um, you can do stunts. Um, there's mini games. There might even be maybe a free open world mode where you can just drive around and do whatever you want. I haven't played a lot of it yet. I did a couple races. It wasn't bad. Um, they're not the traditional like monster jam trucks, so it's just kind of different style of vehicles put into a monster truck, which is kind of cool. It's a new, unique way of playing it, and a lot of customization. You can pretty much customize the color of your wheels, the color of uh, your your secondary color, your primary color for your vehicle. It's a lot of, for an Xbox game, that's a lot. So, uh, the next game, uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4 for the original Xbox, Platinum Hits. Uh, I've played this game on the PS2, really fun game. Uh, all these Tony Hawk games are really fun. They're just good multiplayer games you can play with friends. Or by yourself if you're just bored. <coughs> if you're just bored. Um, so yeah, that's that one. And then the last one I got here is another Tony Hawk's Underground, actually. Um, I haven't played any of these Underground games on consoles. I played Tony Hawk Underground 2 on the DS. I had that when I was younger. That was a good game. I really love that game. Uh, so uh, this one, I guess we'll find out. I'm, I'm guessing it's very similar to Tony Hawk Pro Skater 4. Uh, just different style of maps, underground maps, like maybe underneath the city somewhere in the sewer maybe or something. I don't know. It looks it looks kind of cool. So and these these games are overall are really fun. So figured why not get it? It was like again like five bucks. So cheap games. Uh, not a lot of people collect for Xbox, so it's one of the cheaper systems to collect for, so that's why I go for it, and uh, it has a lot of good games, so. So yeah, that is a bunch of pickups I got for the last little while. Um, I also had one other pickup that I had, but I'm not going to show in this video. Uh, I'm going to be doing a separate unboxing video of that, so stay tuned for that video as well. Thanks for watching, guys, and uh, if you liked it, hit that like button. Also subscribe and uh, as always, I will see you guys soon.